This message goes to all international organizations, the United Nations, Human Rights Watch, and other human rights organizations in the world, the International Criminal Court, ICC, the European Union, international governments, the government of UK, the government of America, the region, Canada, France, Italy, the government of Germany, Russia, Netherlands, Switzerland, China, and other countries. On behalf of peace-loving Ugandans and patriotic Ugandans, I call upon you to intervene in matters concerning human rights abuses, unlawful arrests, abductions and kidnappings that is going on in Uganda as we are heading for the general elections 2021. People are disappearing, allegedly in the hands of the security. Police brutality is on the rise. Journalists are working under intimidation. They are no longer free. Sentiments based, sentiments and statements based on tribal differences is causing fear amongst Ugandans. The country is in state of fear. Let's intervene and rescue the situation to avoid the bloodshed that is likely to occur in our country. Uganda actually is experiencing the symptoms same as those the world witnessed that caused the bloodshed and, and um, genocides in countries like Rwanda. You witnessed what happened in Kenya, in Burundi, in Ivory Coast, in DRC, Central African Republic, and other countries. It's not too late. We can save the part of Africa from bloodshed. The international community come for the rescue of Ugandans. The, those who cannot speak, those who doesn't have the voice, those who cannot be listened to, they need your attention. UN, Ugandans need your attention. UK, Ugandans need your attention. Come for their rescue. Journalists, we need your attention. We are living in fear. We are living in hiding.